Are we in a trade war? Uh, we're on our edge. I think it would be very sad if we do because the presumption is that uh, foreigners are ripping us off. Uh, it's nonsense. Uh, the best example I can give you of how we get our trade deficits is my own personal experience. When uh, I first started out in business, I bought a Chevrolet and then a Buick. And as my little business prospered, I moved up the scale. And I eventually bought a Lexus, which is a Japanese car. When I went to the dealership and put my order in, they bought the, the, the car. That was an import into the United States. I volunteered it. I, it was my decision. They did it for me. I wasn't. Be, I was yes, and we import a lot more than we export. And the question of, uh, you know, the, the whole issue of the trade deficit is being put upside down. It is true that uh, uh, merchandise trade net is uh, close to minus 800 billion, but uh, half of that, or more than half, uh, is offset by services. Of course. But, but it doesn't, I mean, no matter how many matter. smart economists like you say this, the president has pursued his policies and he's going deeper and deeper into it. And now we're, we could even expect a $50 billion worth of tariffs on Chinese goods. The question is, what does that do to the well, U.S. economy and the global economy? Well, the first thing what it does is that when you put a tax, uh, uh, any sort of tax on a good, the question is who pays for it? The United States pays for it. Uh, when the tariff is there. But basically what he is talking about is something quite different. Uh, we are, remember that when we import something, uh, we buy it with a claim. We give the claim to a foreigner and it's a 50, and it's an even, it's an even deal. But our trade deficit, which is for merchandise account, is uh, close to $800 billion, as the president says. Uh, it's offset to a large extent by services. By services. $500 billion total uh, yeah, exactly. deficit. So, uh, I, I mean, I guess what I'm wondering is, we've, we've had this great economic recovery and this burst of growth. The president may even get his 3% number on GDP, thanks to lower tax rates and improved confidence and a number of other factors. How much does that get hurt? Or do you think it does well, get hurt by the trade policies? Frankly, not terribly much so. Uh, remember that the issue here is uh, uh, basically uh, uh, what's going on in the world economy and how are we affecting it and what we are doing. Uh, and international trade, like everything else, is double entry bookkeeping. We are exchanging our paper, whether it's dollar bills or treasury notes, for goods and services. It's a zero-sum trade. And so uh, the, 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 the view that uh, uh, it's unfair and somehow is mistaken, and most importantly, it is essentially uh, the, the numbers that we're talking about are initiated largely by American citizens. This is not a ripoff by foreigners. There's nothing. The, 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 yeah. He's got the president's got the sign reversed.